Britain's sprint legend cut a frustrated and angry figure as the latest chance to close in on Eddie Merckx's milestone went begging It is now almost two years since Cavendish crossed the line first on the tour, and he is just three days short of the most barren run of his career in the race Before takeoff in the Venti last weekend, the Manx missile was quietly optimistic he could add to his 30 stage wins this week, but admitted Merckx's record of 34 seems so close, yet it is such a long distance away And if he keeps going up dead ends, we can name the date when Cavendish, now 33, will catch Merckx, the 12th of never After quick steps Fernando Gaviria charged to his second win in four stages, Cavendish cradled six-week-old son Casper by the finish line He admitted, I was blocked by my own let-out man effectively, but it's my own fault I shouldn't have been there, quick step are hard to beat anyway, it's another stage win for them, and I'm left holding the baby Cavendish was not even in the mix when the first two stages unfolded as sponge sprints and his team Dimension Data Let Out train was stopping at all stations This time, he sat up inside the last 100 yards, gesticulating angrily after brushing shoulders with Holland's Dylan Grenuagen, but in reality Cavendish had already shot his bolt Defending champion Chris Froome and the big hitters in the general classification all rolled home safely But David Laparchant, president of world governing body UC and mayor of Sarzo, where the 121-mile run from Le Ball finished, fanned his war of words with Sir Dave Brailsford The Team Sky principal had accused Le Parchant of bias in presiding over Froome's salbutamol case with the local French mayor's mentality, but Le Parchant's return observe was inflammatory more than conciliatory He said, by insulting me like that, he is insulting 35,000 mayors in France and the French in general He does not understand that it takes mayors taking stages of the Tour de France for such a great event to take place, 